really happy with the just open sounds we're getting from this room. But as I mentioned before, I do a lot of breakbeat drumming and, and stuff that references, you know, 70s and, and 80s tracks. So I need to be able to get a really tight, dry sound pretending we're in a 70s drum booth. So what we're going to do next is we're going to build some gobos. I have another pile of stuff coming from GRK Acoustics, a bunch of compressed fiberglass and some uh, Guilford of Maine cloth. Need to get... Uh, Need to get Tomas and Jack back in. We're gonna build gobos on uh, on a Sunday. What I've been doing is adding these uh, corner braces. That's space age technology, right? That's what they use on spaceships. And here we are, three sets of gobos. I'm not sure at the end of the day if it's actually cheaper to build them yourself or buy them pre-made, but we're happy with how they turned out and here they are. So next, we're gonna put these around the kit. We're also gonna hang some extra sound blankets. These are a producer's choice, um, heavy duty packing blankets, and they do a great job of just really containing cymbal bleed. And imagine that this is our version of a 1974 drum booth that's covered in ugly shag carpeting floor to ceiling. Let's hear what it sounds like. 